in the UK phone hacking scandal. CNN has learned British police are expanding their investigation, and it's going beyond Rupert Murdoch's News of the World tabloid to include many other newspapers. That's been confirmed by the British Information uh, Commissioner's Office. Richard Green is live for us in London this morning. So when we say beyond News of the World, is it also beyond News Corp? Absolutely, Kieran. What we're finding out is that the investigation is now spreading basically across all the major British newspapers. So far, the investigation is focused on one particular private investigator who was working for News of the World. They are now looking into a second private investigator, and we, we, we find that he had something like 300 journalist clients at a whole bunch of different newspapers. All right, what, do we have specifics as to uh, what we think they've done, or is it that they're, they're expanding their, uh, their investigation because they've got some clues that it might be more widespread than the Rupert Murdoch papers? Well, in fact, we know that the illegal obtaining of information is, is more widespread than that. There was a report up five years ago, the information commissioner, the guy who's in charge of data protection uh, in the UK, did a big report into a specific private investigator, laid out a chart. There is a list of all the papers that were involved, how many journalists, how many stories were involved. And the police are now saying they want the information commissioner's files on that private investigator as well. Now, is this just tabloids, or are we talking uh, the mainstream uh, straight papers as well? I mean, I know there's a huge uh, competition. The upmarket tabloids? I'm sorry? <laughs> the upmarket tabloids. Yeah. The upmarket papers? Just, uh, I mean, Overwhelmingly, I know, you know, the ones people... listed here are the tabloids. I mean, these are mostly what the British call the red tops, and, you know, you have uh, garish stories on the front page and stories about royals and celebrities. But this private investigator did work for a couple of the highbrow papers as well. Uh, that doesn't necessarily, he, he obtained illegal information, there's no question about that. Some of the papers are saying, look, there is a public interest defense, there was a reason we needed this, it was in the public interest, it wasn't just, you know, royals, or it wasn't just some celebrity divorce. There is a genuine public interest. So we don't know exactly why all the papers sought the information they were seeking. It is mostly the tabloids, but it's not only tabloids.